welcome today is gonna be a very short how-to video and a lot of questions I've been getting lately is that you know Diwali is coming up and people want to make like Sahina Pilori and all of these things and where they live especially out here in the US they cannot get the spit, split pea powder or the split pea flour or the dal flour so in this video I'm just gonna show you guys how you can get that and you can make it for yourself at home and it's not a hard process so what you'll need for this is I'm going to show you all a small amount which is just a half of a cup of split peas and if you can't even get this in your supermarket then you can use the garbanzo beans, the chickpeas or the chana so if you cannot get the dal or the split peas all you have to do is substitute chana or chickpeas for dal and it works just the same so you take your split piece or your dal and then you go over to your sink and you're going to rinse this until the water runs clear. So I'm going to do that and then I'll be right back. Okay, so I washed that dal out and I put back some more water in here and I'm going to leave this in here because we want that dal to soak and we want it to be able to absorb that water and plump up so once that happens it may take a couple of hours maybe less once that happens then we'll move on onto preparing this so here I have my split peas or my dal that soaked and plumped up and what you're going to do now is drain this water out of here okay take your split peas and place it into your blender Now I have one cup of water here but I'm not going to add all of it. I'm just going to add about a half of the cup. Actually I'm going to just put a quarter of a cup. And then I'm going to blend this. What you need to do is blend this into a very smooth paste. Now if it's getting thick you just add a little more water at a time. But you don't want it to be too wet or too runny. So now you're going to cover this and blend until it's very smooth. Okay, so I need a little more liquid, so that's another quarter cup. Okay, so for that half a cup of dal, I use half a cup of water. So let me just show you all the consistency that you're looking for. Okay, so you see the consistency? This is what you're looking for. Now, some of you may ask exactly how much water I used, and I'm, I told you half a cup, but if you need more, you can add more. You just don't want this to get too runny. Now, I just want to show you all how smooth it is. It's not lumpy, it's not very chunky, it's a very, very smooth paste. Now, with this, you can add some flour to this and you can make your own split pea paste for sahina or you can use this to make pilori by just adding the correct amount of flour to this. Now this is a half a cup of dal here. If you wanted to make pilori with this, you probably could use two cups of flour to add to this. Now if you wanted to use this to make curry, you would need to add about one to one and a half cups of water to get this very thin because when you put this to cook it will thicken up really quickly so i also have that curry video on my channel so you just have to look out for that and follow along with that recipe it's basically the same thing you just add enough water make this very 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 thin put it onto your stove and cook it just like i did in my video and you can use this for sahina as i said pilori um bigany if you want to and if you cannot find split peas as I said you can use chana chickpeas or garbanzo beans so you can make this the night before if you want to use it the following day and you could store this in your refrigerator in an airtight container for up to about five days but you don't want to leave it too long because remember this is fresh split peas and this can go salt really fast so i would suggest if you want to use this you make it the day before for the next day no longer than that so i hope you guys enjoyed this quick tutorial on how to make your own split pea paste at home so thank you all for watching and i will see you all another day with another one of my videos enjoy